to work and I'm trying to put my shoes on I'm supposed to get there at 6 45 so I think we're good on time today is the first day of orientation and I'm very excited um I had a banana for lunch this morning or breakfast this morning I am a little frazzled because it's like first day of school jitters maybe We'll make it through. I did like my morning affirmations this morning and it definitely calmed me down a little bit. Um, also, this is a great time to come for parking because I had a really nice spot and it was pretty much empty. But I'm gonna try and go in now. So we'll see you up there. <laughs> got my bags updated and now I have access to the floor. I don't want to show the whole bag. You can kind of see it. The camera makes me look really dark. Now I'm on lunch. Uh, we haven't really done a lot. I hope you guys can hear me because it's very loud outside. But we haven't really done much that was like um, other than daily things like um, daily vitals and morning care for mom and baby and I'm still learning how to like I think I'm getting down how to count baby's heart rate while it's going like 500 miles an hour and my goggles that I got isn't that they cute I think they were because I couldn't um I couldn't try them on until I got them so I think they are like adorable I look so scholarly now. We have to wear these when we go into patients' rooms and stuff, so. I don't know how long my lunch break is, but I'm gonna leave in like 10 minutes. Eat my food. Yes, today was a long day. I'm like, seven o'clock could not come fast enough. It was a, a lot of task work that I, that we're doing, and I had to, like I asked them like, so really you're just checking off boxes, which, I'm totally okay with. I just feel like I'm not able to use my critical thinking as much as I expected to in nursing. Mom's tasks are usually like making sure her bleeding is not progressively getting worse. We're looking at her pain. Um, we're giving a lot of medications like Toradol and Tylenol. Oh, the lighting, yes. Pull epidural out of a patient's back and I'm like, oh my gosh, I don't think I've ever seen the epidural, what that looks like. So it's really just a line. Oh my gosh, look at how light. <gasps> wow. Okay, you guys know I love sunlight. It wasn't anything crazy, honestly. Like I, I mean, there was a patient that was complaining about some sort of side effect for her medication, but it wasn't that like serious of an issue at all i think tomorrow we'll do better maybe we'll have some more things to do and um it won't be as slow as it was today so. good morning guys this is day three of my three day stretch I am finally on my last day of orientation for this first week and it's been going really well. I am on my way to work now and it's, um, I've gotten a lot better with getting up, I'm supposed to get there at 6.45. I've been getting there like right at 6.45 and rushing. So today I am doing much better because I woke up a lot earlier. So this is day three, so hopefully I'll be able to do more things independently. I was able to do um, all morning assessments by myself the other day, and that was great.
great. It was not that bad. I also have done like baby's first bath and um, I haven't done baby's 24 hour screening yet, but um, hopefully I'll be able to do that soon. But I have started charting, started learning how to chart and um, doing like hourly roundings and stuff like that. Also, I got new shoes yesterday because the shoes that I've been wearing are not as comfortable as I thought they were. Every day I'm coming home and it's, um, and my feet just hurt. So these I tried on yesterday and they felt good. So we'll see how they feel after 12 hours. So today I, I think I'll, I'll have like the flow better and um, I'll keep you guys updated. my third shift guys it's been like a crazy wonderful week and I'm like getting a little emotional because I'm like wow I've learned so much in just a week <sighs> so I'm it's about 6 30 so we're about to um do report and basically wrap up the shift but I'm like really emotional because I'm like wow I really made it like I'm really doing this for a living <sighs> So. <laughs> it is the end of my day and I am done for the week. I just wanted like I literally am behind the most prettiest sunset. Well, it's kind of pretty. It has pink and blue. So I had an amazing week. I learned so much. I feel a lot better with my vitals and talking to mom and doing. Um, I did a discharge today. I did... That's what I do. I, I saw two circumcisions. I did an EKG on a baby, which no one around the unit knew how to do. And I'm like, listen, I can handle EKGs on anyone. Just give me the machine. I got this. And um, I felt really confident with that because I'm like, wow. I mean, in the ER is basically all I did. Learning how to chart better. And I got to work on time today. So yay, that was a, an accomplishment. I feel really good about today. My eyes are burning. So I feel like I need to go home and close my eyes and take a nap. Um, it feels really good out here. I just wanted to say thank you for watching my video and I hope my week in orientation week, I know it was probably a little choppy. Um, I haven't picked up the camera to film. I feel like I need, to, I need to get a little bit better with that, but I got the good parts. So I'm just gonna walk back home. <gasps> Look at that sunset. Wow.